Hi, this is Tina with Sid Happens Dog Training and Behavior and the Pot Cake Project. So, um, one of our fellow pot cakers just sent me an email um, asking me how things are going with the dog appeasing pheromone, the DAP collar that we're using for Marco. Um, studies indicate um, that in laboratories at least, they're seeing efficacy that um, these pheromone collars work well um, with dogs. Marco's been wearing his about a week. I have not seen a change. That doesn't mean that there isn't one and that there won't be one over time. But it was a really interesting thing that she said. In particular, that last week with her puppy was really easy and this week is really hard. Um, I am finding this to be super true with Marco. Um, it appears that odd numbered weeks for him are developmentally more difficult than even one. So this week is, he's 14 weeks old, he's easy peasy. Last week at 13 weeks, he was a little bit of a stinker. So um, we're definitely, he's still developmentally moving along and he's meeting all those developmental um, signposts that we want, but I definitely see a big change week to week and it's really, really interesting to me. I'm not sure what it means, it's just something that we're kind of noticing. So on um, weeks that my puppy is being more difficult, I try to slow down. I try to do a lot more review than new stuff. I try to play lots of cooperative games. Um, so we might play games where um, the puppy and I play together um, more than asking the puppy to play with, say, um, another dog or poor, the poor cat. So um, I also tend to give them more naps and to just spend more quiet time with them. Maybe not petting quite so much, but just interacting with them with like coming when called, something that's a little less um, physically, tactily stimulating. Um, but I'm interested to find out if our fellow pot cakers who are raising puppies are finding the same thing, that one week your puppy is relatively easy, the next week your puppy is much more difficult to deal with. So when you get a chance, um, in the comments for this video, please leave your comments if you have something to add to the conversation. This is Tina with Sid Happens Dog Training and Behavior and the Pot Cake Project, and we're talking about developmental stages week to week. Um, and are you seeing a behavioral difference on odd or even numbered weeks? I'm looking forward to hearing from you. Thanks. Bye.